where is Allah? Allah says in the Quran, Annahnu akrabu ilayhe min hablil warid. We are nearer to him than his juggler vein by our knowledge. Our earth diameter is 8000 miles. The solar system size is 180 billion miles. If you take our solar system and place it in the Milky Way, it is like a small red dot in the vast space. The size of our Milky Way is 100 light years. Scientists say that our Milky Way is the smallest Milky Way. In fact, if you take our Milky Way and place it in other big Milky Ways, you cannot even find our Milky Way. And that's how so many Milky Ways unknown forms the universe. It is just like a dot in the vast space, like a small ring lost in Sahara Desert. Use multiplier to understand the size of one inch ring compared with Sahara Desert, which is 3000 miles by 1200 miles. That is the comparison we should make for each of the skies because there are seven skies, one into the other, and at the end of the seventh sky, there is a station of Angel Jibrail, where Angel Jibrail stays and he delivered the message to the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. So the Prophet and Angel Jibrail travel together from Mecca to Jerusalem where they pray with all other prophets and then they ascended the heavens like from our solar system to Milky Ways to sky 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and at the end of the seventh sky that is the station of Angel Jibrail, Siddhartul Muntaha, Angel Jibrail said I cannot travel any further because this is my station, you have to travel alone. So the Prophet traveled alone and he reached the Arsh of Allah and Allah showed him heaven and hell, the consequences of good deeds and bad deeds. So each human being will face those consequences after death. And he returned to the earth and was able to explain his journey.